This tutorial is designed to show students how to generate graphs in SPSS. We have three variables which we're considering, time, consumption, and income. And what we want to do is generate descriptive graphs of these variables. Obviously, after there's time series variables, one of the most important things we can do is generate a line graph of both consumption and income over time. To do so in SPSS, we select the graphs command and chart builder. A dialog box will appear asking us whether we wish to continue and if we have our various variables labelled correctly. We've done this, so we'll select OK. The starting point is essentially a dialog box as such. Now, as I've said, there's various different chart options available, but we want to construct a line chart, so we select Line, and we can either double-click the chart or click and drag it up to our drawing area. I generally work with clicking and dragging variables to where I want them. So, we have a y-axis and x-axis, and our line will appear here. On the x-axis, it's traditional to put time when looking at time series data. And on then the y-axis, we can put either of our variables. So, for instance, we can put consumption here. Now, this is in essence our basic chart created. We have the y-axis and the x-axis. In addition to this, we can add various headings and footnotes. So, if we want to add a title, we simply select title and we add the content over here. So for instance, figure one, US consumption. We select apply and we now have a title added. T1 shows where this appears. If we want to add a footnote, for instance, which might provide us with reference for our data, we can type source OECD national accounts, for instance and again select apply and we can see F1 down here which is where the footnote will appear. Now we simply have to click OK. Our script will run and our graph will be generated with figure 1, our source, time on the x-axis and y-axis being consumption. So we can see our consumption trends upwards over time. Now we want to generate a graph of income. We follow the exact same steps. Again we go graphs chart builder, we select OK, and what we need to do this time is essentially remove, first of all, the variable we had on the Y, and put in income, so essentially just changing the variable. Now, we also need to change our title, so we simply select our tick, and this time we want figure 2, US income, and select apply. Now we already have the source the same, so we don't need to change that. Everything has been done, so we simply select OK. Again, our script runs, and we can see we get our graph generated, where we have income, our title, and our source, and the variable over time. 